Good morning, a good evening, and good afternoon. This is Nathaniel Kempton Productions here today, and welcome back to Railworks a Terrain Simulator 2020. Now, today is something a little bit special. Sorry, I'm just trying to adjust my audio a bit. There we go, sorry. I've got new speakers and apparently turning the control knob on the speakers whilst having headphones plugged in does absolutely nothing. Because that makes sense. Anyway, uh, today we have a new release. This is uh, the second uh, freeware release for the Festiniog. Uh, last time was the uh, for some reason I can't find them was the uh, uh, the Garrets. Maybe they'll come as Welsh Highlands. Yeah, there we go. It was the uh, Welsh Highland Garrets, these boys. But today it is the Hunslets of the Festiniog Railway, namely the two ladies, Linda and Blanche. So Blanche is the first on the list, so we shall have a look at her. Uh, where is her tender? Come to think of it, generally, oh there. Oh okay, there we go. Are they both the same colour, are they? Yeah, okay, right, that's fine. No, didn't want you, Linda. Right. So, for now, we're just going to chuck a, a driver's icon on it. And then go into play mode and see what happens. Okay. So, before I click on her, we're just going to have a look around externally for a minute. Uh, cold textures are a bit flat, but this is freeware. Uh, overall, though, these textures, uh, they look fairly high quality, to be honest. And obviously there's some things that... That looks like an electronic switch. Is that meant to be there? What is that weird texture in there? You seen that? Those lines. That's a little bit strange. Uh... I tell you what, though, overall, whoops, quite impressive so far. She doesn't look bad. Yeah, she's looking all right. No, uh, no lamp irons though, which is curious. Are there any on the back? No, that's odd. Does she have lamp irons? I don't know. Uh, yeah, I know. I, I like the look of this so far. It looks all right. Right. Let's click on her now. There we go. Right. Jump in the cab. She's a uh, left-hand drive, apparently. Yep. Uh, oh, bit of a gap on the floor there. I don't know if that's accurate or not, but it's there. Uh, can we swap sides? We can. Any other cab views? Nope. What's the heads-out cab view like? Uh, a little bit far. A little bit far out, but not too bad. It looks a little bit high, actually. The roof is there. Uh, yeah, my, my head doesn't go up that high. That's not how how physics works, anyway. So let's take the brake off. Put her in full forward. Uh, and I'm rolling on the level. So that's interesting. Uh, what happens if I open the drain cocks? Oh, that still. It's not how drain cocks work. It's not even slightly how they work, but whatever. It's free. Where? What do you expect? Uh, yep, the road is set. So uh, let's test the whistle. That's not bad. Bit loopy, but that's alright. What's the short whistle like? Uh, bit of a disappointment. Oh, 
I expect we'll get a uh, an update on that eventually. Um, so without further ado, let's just take it for a drive. Obviously, the exhaust sounds and the track sounds aren't going to be particularly much to shout home about. Because it is, obviously, freeware. Right, let's put these brakes into the running position. There we go. Yeah! Yeah! Not bad, really. Okay, the headlamp magically appears on the uh, lamp iron that doesn't exist. It's curious. Track sounds are a bit poor, really. I mean, I know it's freeware, but, you know. Yes, it's freeware, but it is 20... It's when it's when nearly 2020 now. Surely you guys can do better than that. I mean, oh okay. She doesn't fit on the track. Get what? Is that a thing? This is Corris Railway Track. Shouldn't they all fit? That's a bit confusing. Yeah. No, I like it. I mean, the firebox just pops open. But at least there's a little bit of glow. So that's nice. It's a bit delayed. <laughs> but it's there. That's nice. Yeah, okay. So, I think it's time we chuck some coaches behind. And uh, see how she performs with a short... Uh, passenger train. So let's find some suitable coaches. Uh, coach 102. Uh, where's the... Yeah, some of these don't work for some reason. Uh, nope, I'm after... I'm after the observation car. I don't remember which uh, number coach that is. There we go, that one. That's the one I'm after. Slam that down. And then... That's one, two, three, four... And... Uh, nope, not that one. Not that one. That one. There we go. Five coaches. That seems... Adequate. Let's see... How she looks. Okay, full forwards. Brakes off. Let's go. I put my headlamp on because I it, it's there. Not as nice sounds as on the uh, uh, the Garrett. Now that's been updated. But they're not bad. They're pretty... They're, yeah, they sound okay, I suppose. You know, she looks quite alright on this route. For those wondering, this is uh, a route of my creation. This is the Christwell and Marches Valley... Uh, no, Liar. The Christwell and Marches uh, Railway. Uh, in fact, uh, this is the Marches Valley Extension. Tell you what, though, we're losing pressure quite a bit. It's only a 1 in 100 with five coaches on. Let's try and chuck a bit of coal in. I've got my dampers open. I'll... Blower won't really do a lot while we're running, but I'll open it anyway. Just because I can. Passengers get a decent view, I suppose. 
Not quite sure how that's there, but it is. Right, the gradient has dropped a bit now, so I'm going to drop the uh, regulator off a bit. I'm going to aim to coast at about 18 miles an hour-ish, if possible. Yeah, the sound's really up, must have shout at home about. But, I tell you what, I think she looks quite at home. I just hope that there is a, a sound update coming eventually. I'm sure there will be. They've done it with the Garrett's. It's just a matter of time. My screenshot didn't work. I... Okay. That was interesting. Right, let's... Oh, no, not that one. Let's get that off. I'll do it manually then. I don't care. Somewhere there, I reckon. I'll have to use F12 this time. Let's see if it works. Yeah, there we go. There's our thumbnail. Don't know why. Yeah, Shift 2's not working at all. That's very curious. But, oh, well, whatever. What's our boiler pressure doing? Yeah, falling slightly, but we're approaching a station now, so who cares? Uh, yeah, I like it so far. The short whistle is a bit of a disappointment, but, you know, I mean, it's... It's a freeware loco. It's not, you know, didn't cost me anything apart from about an hour and a half of my time because fucking UK train sim website is stuck in 2002 for no fucking reason. I still don't know why they make us queue. I mean, it it's painful enough waiting for the bloody... for the freaking download to work, let alone piss in queuing as well. It just takes the piss. Anyway. There we go. There's a couple of uh, thumbnail options there. So I'm probably going to stop this train, or the video rather, at High Vale. Um, end the video there. We've seen how she performs very well so far. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I'm actually quite impressed. Which was a surprise, really, because uh, I've not had a lot of faith in uh, free we uh, bleh, in uh, free. I can't talk. Free wear things lately. Uh, so yeah, I'm pleasantly surprised. So uh, let's see how she is at stopping. I like watching the motion. That's quite fun. I like the little uh, waggly bit there and the uh, the old steam chest. Something I like about these particular Hunslets is the uh, valve gear design. I think it's a really interesting design. And the fact that it uh, inclines at about 40, 45 degrees. Um, a little bit like uh, the crabs. The LMS crabs. were very much the same. Oh! Could I have stopped any more perfectly? Could I be any better at driving? Actually, yeah, I probably could. Um, okay, so that then is, uh, is, the, is the Festiniog Railway ladies. Well, Blanche, anyway. Linda will be basically the same. So there's not a lot of point in uh, showing that. Showing her because she'll be identical. Uh, yeah. Handbrake on, take the brakes off. I'm actually quite impressed. I like it. I mean, the sound set is not much to shout home about. I grant you that. But the modelling is fine. The cab looks quite small. I don't know if that's accurate. I've never actually seen this loco in real life before so I can't really comment on that 
Like, she's a little bit shorter than the coaches are, um, which is curious. Again, I don't know if that's accurate or not. I've never actually seen the ladies. I've only ever seen uh, the double fairies. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't know. I can't really comment on that. But, overall, quite good. Thank you very much for watching and uh, goodbye.